Hey all, let's get ready for combat. Open up your tournament situations and tactics area. Right here today, we're going to focus on not my blind, particularly pot odds. So when you open it up and you go into the area, you're going to find this situation of a 3x raise and a flatter. We're going to be in the big blind with anywhere from about 100 big blinds, 90 to 100 big blinds, and, and it changes each time you open it up. Your hand is also going to change. You might have a premium hand like this, or the situation might be you have a very marginal hand. So how you're going to react and respond in these situations is everything. It's, it's the key to why we need to train in this combat. One of the tips I want to give you is to open up multiple tabs like I do here, even on the site. So you can access different uh, areas of the site and utilize the tools without leaving your combat. It really helps. As you can see, I've ranged my two opponents here. Uh, who are both, uh, this person is loose passive, and then I put in my hand and I can see I have 21% equity. So if it's a math decision, when we go back to it, we look at our odds, and it's right on the money. So this is a plus EV play, but should I call? Well, my first tip to you is I would increase my equity percentage needed to play because my position is compromised. You have to make up for the um, positional disadvantage. Now let's go back to our situation in which we have a premium hand. Think about is when you have a hand like this, do we juice the pot? Do we pot size raise it or do we just flat? You know, it takes for me when I'm facing an under the gun raiser and a caller, ace queen or better to really re-raise in this spot. And if I do re-raise with ace queen, if the under the gun raiser four bets me, it's easy to get rid of. Queens are better to continue in that spot. But even with ace king here, which is a, a really good hand, I'll go ahead and pot it in. And there, here we go. I've got some success on this one. So there's so many great tools and I'm just now scratching the surface. By the way, if you're not sure how to use some of the tools available here to you on APT, just go over to APT Info right here, drop down to instructional videos, and you're going to see that Steve Blay has made so many great how-to videos. Here it is, how to use the winning odds tool that you can access and learn how to train. We have to learn how to train, then we've got to go into training so that we can get ready for combat and win that war those battles across the green felt. Now, if you would like more in-depth on this, you have the time and the inclination, we're going to offer an extended version to this as well. For now, go out, get ready for battle, and win your wars on the poker felt. I'm Kenneth James.